Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1, Fathead Candy Roth. Your big day out with Evan in the city. Out. Yeah. yeah. Uh, KC doesn't do that city stuff, huh? He goes, yeah, but not as much. Listen, okay. he's a golfer. He's married. He's got a wife. You know. I understand. Oh, you still got one left, Candy. Still got, got one. one left. <laughs> Thank goodness. Uh, we will get. I told you if uh, it ever came to saving me or having to take care of me, I think Evan would step up quicker than one, Casey. One hundred percent. Love me. They both love me. It's just the way of the world. Yeah, we've discussed that. That is clear to me that Evan yep. would be first at your doorstep, no yep. doubt. Uh, but, hey, listen, um, I'm sure Casey would pitch in at some point. Totally. No, he wrote me the most beautiful birthday card. Mm. Evan doesn't do that. You know, like write these emotional things oh. down. He never does that. Casey, I, I got tears in my I almost burst into tears. That is it's beautiful. Beautiful. It's beautiful. Yeah. Uh, Candy, we will discuss in a little bit our time apart. I got some things uh, first to share with you. Uh, this incredible article about some of the wackiest things that uh, people have come into the doctor with. I okay? can only imagine. A guy showed up to the ER with a minor cut, and there was red powder all over it. Turned out he put paprika on it to stop the bleeding. He thought that would work, Kim. Oh, that's a new one. I never heard of that. Yes. Um, a lady called her doctor to ask if her hemorrhoid cream would still work while on vacation, because on the bottle it said... Apply locally. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. Apply it locally. Who's watching her? <laughs> Apply it. This is very, very scary. Apply it locally. No, honey, it won't work on your vacation, you stupid. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Here, here is uh, the best. A baby came into the doctor with a really bad diaper rash. Mm. And the mom, as it turned out, before she put a diaper on, would pour water into the diaper and then put it on the baby. Now, why would she do that? Well, because on diaper commercials, they pour liquids into the diaper. Oh, stop now. Yes, Candy. Is this the stupidity hour or what? To show how uh, absorbent the diapers are. You know how they pour water on the diaper commercials? Oh. She decided to pour water on the diapers before she put them on Wow. Her kid. Wow. Here's three bizarre medical stories for you this morning. you know, and it's not easy being a doctor. I can only imagine. Yes. Uh, It is National Vanilla Ice Cream Day today. You know, that's still like the number one favorite whenever anybody is asked. It always, nobody I know picks vanilla, but apparently a lot of people are. I would take vanilla as my top choice. Um, As a matter of fact... If I am going to have vanilla ice cream, I could have it plain. I could have it with a little whipped cream and chocolate sauce. Sometimes I'll throw a couple chocolate chips on there. Look at you. But I uh, like a yeah. twist, a frozen custard, chocolate and vanilla twist. I have no problem. Uh, love chocolate ice cream. I'll accept that as well. Um, by the way, lo- pralines and cream, you know, is my favorite. Love pralines. Uh, I do. It's delicious. So good. Oh, we yeah. didn't discuss your chicken dip. Oh, oh, good. wait. We'll get to that in a second. Good call. Um... And it is National Gorgeous Grandma Day. Oh, my grandma was gorgeous. To all the grandmas in the audience, including my mother and, of course, my mother-in-law, it is Gorgeous Grandma Day today, Candy. What makes me want to see them get down in a mud fight, the two of them? I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm sorry. (laughs) Candy, I... I hope one day... I'm going to put that comment aside. I hope one day... That I uh, can uh, call you uh, Gorgeous Grandma. Yes, I will be a Gorgeous Grandma. Don't you worry. I really, really oh, hope. Oh, me too. Me I th- too. I think it's in From the works. Your How do you think? Mouth, you know, I th- I'm hoping. Yeah. I'm hoping. Uh, I try to stay out of it, though. Uh, once that word goes, yes, we are, mm. I'll be at their house a lot. To I bring know. Food and maybe force feeding Jackie because I don't think she eats enough food. Yeah, so you'll you'll have to do that. Yeah. Uh, Candy, yes, I'm glad you brought up the chicken dip a second ago. Yeah. Because uh, about a week ago, you mentioned that BJ's... Yeah, at the beginning of the week, I couldn't believe it. Right. Now, at the beginning of the the pandemic, 
I found this frozen chicken dip in the frozen section of BJ's, and it was amazing. I bought it, oh, I, and then it was gone. One day, I bought a million of them. I went back, you know, a couple weeks later. They were gone, and, I, and through some searching online, I found out that it was discontinued. And you may recall, I went to a lot of different places, you Candy. You did, you did. And then I told you Trader Joe's has something like that, and you ran there, but it wasn't the same. Right, no. Now it was, I'm walking, it was tra- good, hold on. not the same. Right, it was good, not the same. Now, you're walking through BJ's the other day. Yep. You, you see in the cold section. Yes. A new chicken dip. I said, oh my goodness, does Fathead know about this? So I needed some half and half and some other things yesterday, so I stopped in. And I found it, and I bought. I, I I stopped myself. I bought one tub. I bought. Well, because you know what, I lost my interest in chicken dip after a while. <laughs> well, so, you had twenty five containers of it. Maybe right. that's why. That's probably why. So I bought one, and it's a pretty good sized tub. It is. And uh, it tastes exactly like the old BJ's Ooh, one. Oh, now it? I'm gonna get it. Now yeah. I, I didn't. I held off, and now you are my taste tester. I will be getting it. Really, really good. I was uh, I was really excited about oh, it. Oh, I'm yes. happy I could find that for you. You texted me, you're like a drug addict, with a yeah. picture of chicken dip. No, you're like my drug dealer. Dealer, yes. correct. I got it wrong. You're you right, are. Because I uh, led you down that path. That is that is correct. Uh, Candy, a couple of good news stories, then we'll we'll finish up and, and discuss our departure from each other. Oh, my cry. A six-year-old girl, Mississippi. Called 911 last week and hung up, so they called back. She just wanted to tell the sheriff that she loves him, Candy. Aw. So the sheriff showed up to her house two days later with a bunch of school supplies for her. That's very sweet. How about this? A bunch of high school students in Maryland had a teacher whose husband is in a wheelchair. Mm. They built a baby carrier attachment for wheelchairs so the teacher's husband could take the baby out with him. That is the... That just did me in. And Whoa. they won two awards for it. Oh, as well they should. And then back in May, a five-year-old boy, Meyer Mixdorf, was being treated for brain cancer, Children's Hospital in Missouri. His parents used sticky notes to make faces on his window to cheer him up. Then someone across the street started doing it. Turned out to be a medical worker in another building. So they went back and forth exchanging incredible messages with sticky notes and big pictures and stuff. So um, they didn't even know. She, the person across the street didn't even know the five-year-old boy. But finally got to meet him last week when his MRI came back clean, Candy. Oh, wow. That's wonderful. And he got discharged. Yes. Oh, I love that story. Beautiful. Uh, Candy, um, we will be apart for 10 whole days. We will. You know, absence does make the heart grow fonder. Yes, we will come back bigger and better than ever. Yes. Not bigger, but better. (laughs) But better. I will um, be away next week, and then you... Uh, have I will be off next Friday and Monday. Uh, right. We won't be together, though, next week. Right. And I'll see you Tuesday the 3rd. Good luck with uh, Tilly being spayed. Thank you. I know you'll check in on me. Absolutely, I will check in. Um, I can't wait to find out how everything goes. I'm sure it'll be great. Um, I want you to have a fantastic time apart from me, Candy. Too. I'll try. You have a wonderful vacation with all of your children and your wife. Yep. That's all that's going, right? That's it. the in-laws with you or anything. No, no, all of right. course all not. Right. Okay. Of course not. Think about that battle, though, I'm thinking about with the <laughs> mother-in-laws. Huh? Could be a good one. The mud wrestling with the grandmas, yes. yeah. Oh, uh, that would be so funny. Candy, we will uh, we will part now and uh, enjoy. Um, just write down anything that happens to you in the next 10 days. Write it down, okay? I'll write it down. You do the same. We'll yeah. gather again with lots to talk about. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1.